Let's make ten trees. And, uh, yeah, I can. Sweet. Or was it fifteen? I think it was fifteen. Whoops. I'm good at having that. Why are you keeping bing, bing, bing? Just plop a bunch of thorn trees down. Oh, no, it's too heavy. I guess I put a tree here. Where's... Oh, there it is. Whatever. <laughs> Clean it up later. I ain't no artiste. Oh no, but I am messing up the balance of this world. Peaceful music. These brick houses must really weigh it down. Really, the trees are just here to help you balance stuff out. For however you make make it. That church must weigh a ton. That's a lot of stone right there. Uh, come on. I know I can fit it in there. Or whatever. I'd have to spin it around or something. I think as I can't tell which is the most heaviest one. There's a very slight difference. Oh, is that all? Okay, that covers a bunch of stuff. Jeez, yeah, it certainly does. Oh yeah, Lodge House Bistro stored. That was easy. All I had to do was place down 15 trees and voila. Now where's the warp? It's gonna probably indicate that there's a change in the future. It's ironic because I don't think I remember seeing trees in in Starlight Canyon. So what's the point of placing down trees? Somehow these trees are connected to the future. You never know. It is like what is it? how many years is it in the future? A thousand, I think. These trees were essential to Starlight Canyon in the future where they are not, there's no trees present at all. This tree grows up to be Lao Chao. Look at that! Yeah? Hey, it's Lao Chao's bistro. And how did Max know that? Look at that! That's Lao Chao's Bistro! You've never been here before! How do you know that? I don't know. That doesn't explain much. <laughs> oh yeah, you get winded easily. Oh, it smells really good! Mmm, yeah! So, are we gonna go in there or are we just gonna stand and gawk at the entrance? Well, let's first see if there's any goodies to collect. Because those are always good. Oh, look. Walkie here. Some good stuff. A potato pie. Mm. Oh, I almost missed that. Fruit of Eden. So when is Adam and Eve connected to the story of Dark Cloud? other little chests, any little tidbits. <laughs> oh, wait, what's that? Oh, yeah, I did pass something. Something very good. Sometimes I open a chest and it's like, what the fuck is this? And it's like, I think it's like Mimi or something random. Oh, look, I'm trying to sneak in here. I think getting past me. I'm sure I probably passed something. It's like, oh, you idiot! I don't see anything else until I cross this bridge. I see something. Put this up. Oh my god, all of this is defense upping stuff. That's good. I'm just waiting for one to disappoint me. So far, not really. <laughs> Usually, if I give something like a garnet, that's good. He's good. Uh, is there something on the sides? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I thought something almost looked like a chest tucked right in the corner there. Optical illusion and such. Cut 
cutscene time. Cutscene time. Wow, this is it. Wait, 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 wait a second. He's Chinese. I didn't know. Yep. Hmm. Something smells good. Let's check it out. Or at least everything looks Chinese themed. Henceforth, he's Chinese. Are you Lao Chow? <laughs> I think. I love his nostril mustache. Yes, welcome. What can I get you? You don't sound Chinese, but whatever. Actually, we didn't come to eat today. We've got a friend that's very ill. She's in bad shape. It's not like I'm expecting him to be a stereotype, but. <laughs> we want to give her your miracle dish so she can get better. Could you make it for her, please? Hmm, I see. I wish I could help you, but there's a special ingredient I need to make my miracle dish. Of course. A special ingredient? To make my miracle dish, I need a white windflower. People say that it's extinct now. You can't find it anywhere at all. You used to be able to find them flowering in deep valleys. A white windflower, huh? Monica, there's a chance that it might grow back in Starlight Canyon. Yeah, it is the past after all. Okay, Lao Chao, we'll see what we can do. Hmm. If only there was something they could do to preserve this magical flower that could save people from any form of illness instead of letting it die out and being a rare thing a thousand years in the future. But hey, whatever, we're gonna get this one wind flower to save this girl. Not like I'm saying, oh, don't let her die, but find these things in the, so they have it for the future. If it's some miracle flower. I'm guessing it's some kind of medicinal. But it's being used in the form of food. No, oh, there's the portal. Oh yeah, I got a bunch of good stuff I should use. Max is getting all the defense buffs, and Monica's getting the shaft. Oh well. I guess I could give her a bit of extra health. She actually needs it more than Max, so I'll give her the last three. At least in the meantime. Until she gets some defense ups. No witch parfait for Monica. Oh well. Looks like Max is tanking it up. Let's skip this. As glorious as the animation is. So now we have to go to Starlight Canyon. Am I still hurt? Yeah. Well, hurt because I upgraded health, but whatever. But I need to go to. Oh, there's the station. Go to Cedric and repair my robot. Do, 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 do. I like that clock hands, they actually move. Instead of just being a painting on the wall like in all other old games. Repair robot parts. That was magical. Hey. Now we move to Glorious Starlight Canyon. Yorda's Valley. Hurrah! I'm thinking, I think this is where we do the Svita thing. I don't know, wait. It's that backtracked area, I believe. But we're supposed to do something here, I guess. Or are we not? Maybe I'm supposed to go to that dead end area now. Okay, dokey. Um, I'm worried about Lynn. Yeah, I guess uh, now I'm supposed to go to that damn dead end area. Oh. Seriously? All I can do is leave? I can't go to the next... Uh, waste of time. How would they know to search 
that dead end area. That's where the event is. Ooh. I haven't done the old lady voice in a while. Marga's Valley. It's a lovely place to be hanging around. Oh. Nice landing. Nice afro. <laughs> Condor, we don't want to fight. We want to ask you something. We never fought before. Why is he saying this? Hmm? What's that now? We're looking for a white wind flower. Have you seen any near here? White wind flower? Haven't heard of it. I bet you could find one from the sky. Will you help us look? Hmm? I don't think so. I've got enough to worry about. What's the matter? Got a rather clear voice for a bird. I don't know. It sounds like it could be a school teacher. Look at that, will you? Some weird old something is up above my home with my dear chicks inside. I'd like to give my sweet children some food, but I can't get near the place. Looks like a time distortion. I guess time is starting to be affected in this era, too. Distortion? That's right. When Griffin disturbed the flow of time, it started to warp and become strained in places. Those places are time distortions. There are already lots of time distortions in my era, but it looks like they've started happening in this time, too. How can we get rid of it? Whenever there's a time distortion, there's always a fragment that falls out somewhere nearby. If you hit that fragment into the distortion, you can make the distortion go away. Really? You can get rid of it? Well, what are you waiting for? I'll help you find your white wind thingy when you're done. Really? Okay, Monica, let's get rid of it. It's not all that easy. You have to do something Here, incredibly on. stupid and sportsmanlike. I knew it was here. Gonna find it. There it is. This is it. Uh -oh. This is a time distortion fragment. It's also called a spear. Be careful. You can't touch it with your bare hands. You hit it with a long stick or something. It's not too complicated, but it's hard to get it into the distortion. We need some kind of long stick to hit the spear with. See if there's some kind of stick handy. Then I'll show you how to hit the spear. Okay. Well, since it's just an area with a lot of smooth textures, I should see something jut out. Oh wait. Aha! Handy stick. Time to do some happy Gilmore shit. Show it to her. I found the stick! Look, I found the stick! Hey, you got one! Okay, let's try it. I suddenly became a silent protagonist. Okay, listen up. You hit the sphere with a stick and send it flying. That's called taking a shot. <gasps> really? Make a good shot and you'll get the sphere into the distortion. But there's one thing you've got to remember. When you hit the time distortion fragment, also called the sphere, against something, it changes color from blue to red back to blue, like that. Oh, I remember pl trying to play Svita in, what's it called? Rainbow Butterfly Wood. <laughs> Not fun. If the distortion is blue, you can only wipe it out with the red sphere. When the sphere and the distortion are the same color, they repel each other and it won't work. So if your sphere is the same color as the distortion, you have to hit it up against a wall or something and change the color back. It's the only way you can wipe out the distortion. Does it have to be within par when I'm doing we this? We call this hitting the sphere up against a wall to change its color bumping. Ooh. You can bump the sphere as many times as you want, but the number of shots you can take are limited, so watch out. 
If you don't get the sphere into the distortion within the allotted number of shots, the sphere disappears and you fail. In my era, we call the act of wiping out time distortions like this, Sfida. Some people even play Sfida like a sport. With the world in danger like this, I know it sounds pretty dumb, but I guess people like to escape from reality. Reality. That's about it. Did you get all that? Want me to explain again? No, 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 I got it. Okay, I you can try it now. Do. Good luck. Okay, let's begin swing, second power level. The impact zone, blah, blah, blah. Hey, I remember you can actually upgrade your stick, kind of like upgrading a weapon, I think. I don't know if you have to kill enemies with it. I'm trying to think. Possibly? <laughs> I got a club. Because I equip it like a weapon. Okay. Where's the damn sphere? How do I change? Is it over? Let me just take a look. Where's that damn... Use first person mode. How do I switch to it? Oh, there. I guess that's where the distortion is. Yeah, just around the damn rock. Okay. I can't do a bending shot, can I? <laughs> okay, let's try aiming for this rock. Maybe it'll ricochet and hopefully I don't overshoot it. Oh, fuck! Oh, shit. Oh, well. Oh, yeah, there's a little uh, star there indicating I should have shot there. Oh, it's a good color. I could just, if I could just straight shot that bitch in there, it's even a bit higher. Hopefully. Okay. Boom. Boom. Oh, la di da shot. Boom, pro. Now oh, that was easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my babies! My babies! I'll get to my dearies. Ooh. Condor, don't forget our deal. Do you have a name, by the way? They're all dead. Suddenly, it becomes a tragedy. <laughs> I'm grateful for your help. Uh, Thank you all so much. How can I ever repay you? Hey, hey look. look! What? What is it? This is it! The flower we've been looking for! How did it appear there? Oh well. It just grew spontaneously. There's a lot more soil than my head now. flower would be growing on my head. <laughs> Take it if that's what you need. After all, it's thanks to you that my children are safe and sound. Thank you, Mrs. Condor. Well, I'm off. Oh, almost forgot. Uh, when that strange hole thingy disappeared a while ago, this fell out. It just gets in my way. Here, take it. A proper one. What a coincidence. See you. Swan. Elizabeth Swan. Now let's go to Lao Chao's Bistro. Come on, can I fly now? Kaboom! Okay. Where's that warp hole? Where's the warp hole? Skip that shit. Skip it. Is 
there any chests that I may have overlooked from the cutscene? Oh. Let's give him the windflower! Wow! Unbelievable! You've got a white windflower! Now you'll make your miracle dish for us, right? Of course! It's been quite a while, but let's give it a whirl. Alright! Or we could try take our use our future devices and replicate the flower before it's gone from from existence and in the future. But whatever, no time to waste. It's got the nerd glasses thing, like the anime nerd glasses. All done. Here you go. Wow. You're supposed to eat that. This will make Lin better. Yeah, let's hurry. Lao Chao, thank you so much. Thank you very much. You guys bowing to me? That's Hope racist. Trick. But you're Chinese, aren't you? No. What the hell made you think that? Jeez. Racists. place and save that sick what how is she sick again I have to check a let's play or something huh? if, unless it wasn't explained yet isn't it from some sort of post-traumatic stress or something or just trauma she's like bedridden from it something lame like that <laughs> Dumplings. Yeah, they look really good too. Hands off! Those are for lit. Oh wait, I already ate them. <laughs> I know, I know. Let's hurry up and get them to her. She's right there. Okay. <laughs> Let's get them to her. Uh. Oh. oh. Eat this shit. Oh great, we didn't even get to see her eat it. Wait, 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 did we just like shove it in her mouth as she was sleeping? <laughs> that sounds wrong. But <laughs> what, did we feed it to her when she's sleeping? Ooh, she's coming too. I, uh, what, what happened? Lin, oh thank goodness you're all better. Maybe the, maybe the miracle dish is a suppository. Argo, please. Master Crest gone off the training? Why didn't he wake me? Lin. Why, Argo? You don't remember, then, about Master Crest? Looks like she's lost her memory. Dum-dum-dum. The sitcom nightmare. Huh? 